Tommy, Laren, where is your father? Why are you asking your mother and rather asking why men are the way they are and complaining about it to your mom? You have no, you have no mention of, uh, of talking to your father about same issues? Where is he? Uh, I am aware that uh, your, your, your mother is a lifelong career woman and you adore her to your uh, praise uh, during uh, International uh, Women's Day. But how about your father though? Hey, how about your father? Where, where is he in all this? Do you, do you value your, your mom's advice? more than your, your father when in regards to uh, dating and men? Hey, I'd like to have an answer to that. Okay. So, I want to focus on one thing here. You make a judgment and a knowledge claim that uh, That uh, men will have a more sustainable, valuable, interesting, value-for-value uh, value, uh, relationship and that you claim it will last longer by saying that it's going to be more uh, sustainable. Well, uh, historically, for, uh, for thousands of years, uh, that is not the case, eh? That is not the case. For thousands of years, we had basically zero career women, super ambitious, and that have things going on, their own company, and they made their own money. Survey after survey after fucking survey. The happiest women are the full-time housewives. Hey, hey. So tell me, eh? A little bit, little bit of information you, you left out, right? Or you'd rather uh, avoid so that, you know, thinking that it uh, doesn't exist, right? But that doesn't work with me. Uh, so when you say uh, that uh, men uh, 15, 20 years uh, uh, older than, uh, than, 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 than women that are, uh, that, than women that they are targeting, that uh, according to you, uh, they have nothing other than being pretty. Uh, no, you're wrong there. Being young and being pretty is often a marker for fertility, for being a a, a uh, potential good housewife and mother to to his kids. But no, eh? Like in your uh, in your train wreck video, you not even once did you mention about family, future children, reproduction, reproducing the human race, reproducing your white race. None. You did not even touch on it. You put the most value, the highest, utmost value that a woman has, that, 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 that a woman should have, according to you, is to be ambitious, a career woman, have something going on, make uh, her, her own money. Okay, uh, what else there? Um, yeah, also that have women that have amazing jobs that work really hard. You put the utmost value on that over a young, fit, healthy woman that is in her 20s where, where her, her uh, eggs reproducing eggs are much more fertile than not as opposed to in her 30s, 40s and beyond, eh? Okay, what else, what else do I have here? Yeah, you call them the Tatianas, right? And yeah, I, I, I would assume, correct me if I'm wrong, that you're referring to a lot of the uh, Russian, Russian overseas women that are dying, literally, so to speak, looking for a traditional conservative man that want to have I want to settle down and have children. Oh, God forbid. 
go god forbid oh that is so pedestrian having children and family right to reproducing to reproduce your fucking dna right oh oh sorry for the swear words here right uh not sorry okay <sighs> You keep saying, you keep saying to men, don't mix us up with the Tatiana the wool. Uh, you are apparently worth over $3 million. And your other successful friends, uh, why do you complain so much? Uh, why is it so hard? You have basically all the means, power, methods to avoid uh, trashy, boyish men. Speaking uh, up on uh, boyish uh, boys are not men. You keep referring to this video to uh, uh, as yourself a girl, not a woman, not a lady. A girl, not a woman, not a lady. And then you have to go to to make a a sweeping judgment that uh, uh, that uh, and you're decrying the pussification of uh, men across America, and where you say, hey. There are more boys than men, even when they're uh, of legal age, 21, uh, 30, 40, uh, and, and older. But all the while, you refer to yourself and your, your girlfriends as girls, not women, ladies. Why is that? You want... Men, not boys, but you keep referring to yourself as girls. Did you get that already? Uh, oh yeah, you decry uh, the Tatianas of the world as 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 uh, not super ambitious and hasn't found herself. Again, you are projecting massively. A value system onto other people that do not have nearly the same value system as you. Oh, several times, at least twice, I've heard that. Uh, you take it as an insult. Oh, oh, you take it as an insult. Boyish, boys pursuing... Uh, Pursuing you as an insult. Oh my God! Jeez! Oh, this is so painful, eh? I take it as insult. Eh, eh, maybe you should go a little bit uh, thicker skin, right? I take it as insult. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, you keep saying, "Oh, we don't want to be in the situation where we have to deal with you and." By, you know, da 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 da. <laughs> go, go. Oh my goodness, man. And, and all other things you call Tatiana's, uh, you know, um, they're not go getters. Again, you, you, you define many words, eh? Value, decent, uh, and, and uh, go getters. Oh, go getters. What if the Tatiana's, they are go getters? They are go getters of men. They want to be a husband and a father to your kids. And they, they want to stay home as a full-time housewife to raise strong, powerful children. Hey, eh? um, What else? Sir? Plans. Oh, oh, oh. You tap your little pad on, on your desk there, eh? Make plans. Make plans. Again, your definition of plans Proper plans also is really not in line in you, right? So when, when you say, oh, you decried the pussification of men across America. Of course, your whole definition of what is the pussification of men across America is very different than apparently which makes it so evident in your train wreck video that, oh, you, you just, you want men to actually not pursue Primarily, women for their reproductive capacity. Hey, because we can't. Hey, biologically, woman, we're not made to make our own sons and daughters and so on. Do you notice that? Oh, makeup. 
Make up, make up. Uh, so, hold on, wait. Why do, why do you work hard to look pretty and put makeup on? I, wait, I thought you want, I thought you wanted men, not boys, to value you for being a go-getter and being ambitious and make your own money and work really hard and having, and have amazing jobs. So, why the makeup then? Eh? What, what is that about? Oh, so, so, uh, yeah, okay, so the other thing, when you, when you say, oh, you, you, you talk to your mom about, uh, you know, dating, the difficulties, and, and, and how, and so on and so on, is it, and about, is it, is it just in part of, uh, parts of the, the, the country or not, and, and, okay, so again, do you ever ask your father for advice, like, about, uh, about uh, dating and stuff like that, right? Uh, maybe not, right? Because, look, I bet you your mom is more the man of the house than your father is the man of the house. Now, I went to see your background and the, the, uh, your parents and so on. She's been, your mom's been working forever. Why? You're the only child. It's not as if the expenses are that high, right? And, and, uh, and for the longest time, as a result, I'm not surprised you've you value, you adore, you praise career ambitious women. That uh, 